Welcome to the FX Options Weekly Outlook, a weekly podcast series hosted by Jason Ayers, a top instructor, trader, and founder of OptionSource.net. Join Jason as he discusses the latest trends in the Forex market with a look ahead on the U.S. dollar versus the major currencies using the most commonly used technical indicators. Well, hi there and Happy New Year. Welcome to the ISE FX Options Weekly Outlook for January 4th, 2011. This is Jason Ayers of OptionSource.net. As always, let's take a quick look at the weekly chart of the U.S. dollar index. This is a great way to gain perspective as to how the U.S. dollar has been trading against a basket of currencies. Well, the U.S. dollar lost some ground over the holidays, but uh, our bigger picture support at 79 still remains intact. Now, 8081 continues to pay, play a role as resistance and is likely to be tested on a bounce. A move deeper into 78.79, however, lends credibility to a continuation lower with 76 as the next support. Let's take a look at our daily snapshot here. Well, we need to see a positive bar uh, come in here at 79 to lend credibility to a move higher. A break below 79 is likely to test 78 for near-term support. Let's take a, take a look at the CDD, the U.S. versus the Canadian dollar. Well, the CDD broke a major support at 100 after selling for the last two weeks. We do suspect to see some retracement after such a uh, significant move. However, failure to break back above 100 opens the window for a continuation all the way down towards this 97.98 focal zone. Next up, the YUK, the U.S. versus the Japanese yen. Well, the YUK lost significant ground, hitting a low of 81. We expect a retracement. However, 81 and a half, 82 will act as a significant resistance. So failure to break above 81 and a half lends credibility to a continuation lower to test 80. A break and a close above 81 and a half should follow through with a move towards 83. Let's take a look at the EUI, the U.S. versus the Euro. Well, the EUI slipped lower to test support at 74. Any attempt higher is likely to meet with resistance at 76. Ferry to hold support at 74 suggests a uh, move towards 71. Next up, the BPX, the U.S. versus the British pound. Well, the BPX continues to consolidate above 64. However, failure to hold 64 is likely to, to suggest a move towards the 63 level. The near-term trend does appear to be up with the 66, 66 and a half focal zone as a logical target. Let's take a look at the AUX, the U.S. versus the Australian dollar. Well, the AUX has broken below a key support at uh, 99, but uh, it is due for a retracement that should uh, see a move uh, back up to this 100-101 focal zone. A continuation lower is likely to, to look for support at the 95-96 box. Let's take a look at a few of our key points. First of all, the U.S. dollar index spent the holiday selling off back down to the 79 level. This remains a key support. Failure to hold this level opens the window for a continuation lower. The CDD started the new year below the 100 level. Unless we see a break back above 100, the pair is likely to test support at 97.98. The YUK reversed off of the 84.5 resistance level and subsequently sold off to 81. We may see a retracement after such a significant drop. However, failure to break back above 82 opens the window for a continuation towards support at 80. The EUI failed to break higher and is now testing support at 74. A break below 74 opens the window for a move towards 71. The PPX held its ground over the holidays. If support holds at 64.5, the window is open for a push towards 66. The AUX failed to signal a trade higher, reversing over the holidays and breaking below a key support at 99. Unless we see a break back above 99, the pair has a high probability of slipping back down to test the 95-96 level. And this has been your ISC FX Options Weekly Outlook for January 4, 2011. As always, this is Jason Ayers of OptionSource.net. Thanks for joining me here this week. We'll see you here next week. Thank you for participating in this week's session. Please join us again next week. For trading ideas, exchange rates, webinars, news, and commentary, visit www.fxoptions.com. Become an OptionSource.net member. Visit www.optionsource.net. ISE FX Options can be easily traded through all options-enabled brokerage accounts. These exchange-listed securities are cash-settled in U.S. dollars and have a European-style exercise.